Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Let's Talk. Like I said, I was going to have two or three of these this week, and um, I got one out, so I wanted to get this one out. And I do apologize for the way I look right now. I literally just woke up. I could not sleep last night, um, and ugh, I just uh, got back from trading my Note Edge for an iPhone 6 Plus, so I'm very happy now. I hated Android, so it's good to be back on the Apple side of things, but um, the thing I wanted to talk about today was um, something that's very... It's kind of hard to talk about, actually. It's, I mean, it's not terrible, but it's 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 a very common thing. But it's it's I guess it's some sort of taboo, and that is uh, suicide. Um, and the reason why I talk about this because I had a uh, conversation with my friends. It's about a week ago, and I was going to talk about it last week, but I didn't really know how to tackle it. But um, basically. Uh, we was talking about um, my trip to see the psychiatrist and um, what that entailed. And they ask you all kinds of questions. You have to be completely honest with them about it. And one of the questions was where, I, where I'm clinically, where I have clinical depression is, have I ever um, thought of suicide and or attempted suicide? And... Uh, I had to tell them, and the answer was yes, and there's only a couple people I know um, that knows this, because I've told them, but I figured I'd kind of let you guys know, and this is a true story and everything, I don't want you guys to freak out, because I'm fine now, this was a few years ago, um, but uh, the reason, uh, how it went down was, um, I got out of a terrible, terrible relationship. Uh, but it lasted about a year and a half. The girl I was with cheated on me uh, a number of times and uh, brought her family in to try to live in this house that we was renting. And um, it was a mess. Um, I ended up staying in my car, stayed at an office um, overnight sometime just so I wouldn't have to go home. And um, I was always <laughs> depressed wasn't eating right, uh, I was drinking non-stop, um, and I was on a self-destructive path where I didn't know what to do, and, um, I eventually kicked this girl out of my life, but after that, I was just super depressed, I didn't know what to do, and this is like, um, this was probably back, in, probably four or five years ago, probably about five years ago. And, um, one day I was so depressed that I had a gun and, um, you know, long story short, I almost pulled the trigger on myself and ended it because, you know, I didn't know how to take it. And, you know, that, that <laughs> there's a lot of things that go through your mind when you are staring down the barrel of a gun and, um, that's, you know, your family, your friends, um, things you've accomplished, what you can accomplish, uh, things just flash in front of you. Uh, that, I, I mean, I don't know how it is for anybody else that's done this, but that's what it was like for me. And I eventually stopped myself because the thing, you know, my mom would have been I don't know what would happen with her because it is it would have been terrible. But um, I didn't do it, so uh, luckily, uh, as you can tell, I I'm, I'm alive and well. So, but um, it, if you are depressed and you're thinking about doing something like this, one thing you should probably do is really think about everything everything like your family your friends because it's not worth throwing your life away um for anything i mean if you're going to go just go you know the normal way just live your life and to its fullest and die and that's what i'm doing um and now i you know i 
then I wasn't taking medicine for clinical depression. I wasn't, I, I didn't even know, but you know, I was talking to a psychiatrist. I haven't been taking medicine for about a month now for everything, but, um, it's really not, not, not great. Um, not a great place to be. It's, it's scary. Um, and it'll, it'll take a toll on you, but, um, just, just, if you're thinking about something like that, just hang in there. Don't let things get to you so bad that you have to think about ending your own life. Um, just get out of that situation. Um, hang out with your friends, um, your family, uh, play video games, do something. Don't, don't do that. Um, it's not worth it. And, um, you'll find out, um, which I did, uh, you know, I ended up talking to my friends and stuff like that. And we just had fun. And, you know, the best way to get out of things like that is just, you know, have a support system, your friends, even if you don't want to tell them what you're thinking, maybe, you know, find somebody, talk to them about it. Maybe, I mean, people are willing to help you. They also have hotlines, um, for people to help out with things like that. And, you know, it, it's, it's rough. I'm not going to say that, um, it's easy to, um, go through life and not think about these things, but just don't do it. Um, if you're unhappy with yourself, which I'm fixing myself now, um, the dieting, I'm trying to get myself ready for the surgery and people might say that's an easy way out, but that's a step out of, you know, you know, I'm, cause I'll, if I keep on doing the way I am, I'll be killing myself another way. I mean, <laughs> death by eating, death by that. I mean, I don't want to do that. So, you know, just think about it. Don't, don't throw your life away. Talk to people, have fun, uh, find something you truly enjoy and do it. Just make the best out of it. Uh, suicide just, um, it's just not worth it. And, um, if you want to talk to me, just feel free to, you know, I have my Facebook open. You can message me about, it. you can message me in the comments below, Twitter, Reddit, anything. I, I'm willing to talk to you guys about it. And, um, yeah, I mean, it's, it's not worth it, but guys, I hope you get something out of this. Um, it, I, it took me a while to figure out how I was going to tackle that. And, um, I figured instead of editing, um, like I was, did the last couple of uh, Let's Talks, I figured I'd do a straightforward uh, with you guys. That way you kind of know. But I'm going to hop off here and edit this, uh, not edit, but upload this later. I hope you guys enjoy and be sure to hit like and subscribe. And as always, I love you guys.